Everyone's so excited, we're so happy, we're cheering each other on. You just get so into the game and it's like nothing else. To win an E8 championship is our goal. It's a dream that we all have. I know we can do it too. Let's make sure we work hard, right, from start to finish, and we stress them, right? We stress them, then we get our moments, we make the most of them. Here we go, let's go. The St. John Fisher University women's soccer team continues to contend for championships. Since 2019, the Cardinals have won two conference regular season titles and played in the Empire 8 championship game twice. Putting our goals out there of winning an Empire 8 championship and playing in the NCAA tournament and knowing that we have to put in the effort to get us there. Here we go, pass and move. Building a positive team culture is gonna lead to success. And that's something that we've been putting the time in, um, you know, every day, 365 days a year to make sure that we have the type of environment where our players can come and work hard and take risks and just make a lot of growth in their time here. Fisher has gone unbeaten in conference regular season play three times since 2019. The Cardinals are also earning recognition. Over the last two seasons, 13 players earned all Empire Raid honors. Like off season, in season, I think we're all just working towards the same goals and we all have that same dedication and hard work effort. Everyone is so talented and like going to practice every day and seeing people push themselves like makes you want to work harder. It's so close and tight in it and the soccer team is just like my family. Team building has included a whitewater rafting excursion and they travel for early season competition. In 2023, they went to Boston. We played Emerson College right in the heart of the city, which was fantastic. We did duck tours, we shopped a little bit. It was pretty fun. We had two nights. We can all really bond and do things outside of playing soccer together to really get to know each other and the new girls coming onto the team. That's always one of the highlights, right? Something, some trip that we did, some experience that they remember. So it's nice that they have those memories when they graduate. St. John Fisher University Athletics continues to grow with 25 varsity teams that excel at the conference, region, and NCAA national levels. The Cardinals, members of the Empire 8, have outstanding facilities for training and competition, and Fisher hosted the 2023 NCAA Outdoor Track and Field National Championships. Fisher's home for women's soccer is Growney Stadium. We love the home field. We always say our field's the best field. Our grass field is wonderful as well. We do a lot of training out on that field in preparation for grass games. We take full advantage of our film room. We are typically doing film one or two times a week. As a D3 school, I think we have some of the best athletic facilities there are. The brand new weight room is amazing. Only 10 minutes from the city of Rochester, Fisher is located in scenic and historic Pittsburgh, New York. The 164-acre campus is home to a close-knit community known as the Fisher family. The university has five distinguished schools and offers a variety of majors through a liberal arts education. I feel like I'm very close with all of my professors. All my professors know who I am and we build a good connection. One thing that Fisher stresses is being day one ready. As an accounting and finance major, I have so many opportunities for internships within Rochester. It's a really great area to network. There's a lot to do, like there's a Chipotle nearby, the Trader Joe's is awesome, the Wegmans, one of our favorites, even as a team or just individually, we love to go to Wegmans. There's so many different things you can do in Pittsburgh and in Rochester too, it's great. Let's make sure we're going in line. Get that ball back at an angle. Since arriving in 2019, head coach Molly Romano has taken the Fisher program to a new level of success. And they continue to aim for the top with talent and teamwork. We're very possession oriented. We like to play offense and defense with 11 players. So we're making sure that everybody is involved in the play. Establishing a great foundation, but knowing that we need to be flexible throughout the season. Everyone calls it the Fisher family here and I feel like I've really become a part of that. I just really love the community that we have here at Fisher and happy to be a part of it. I love it here, it's awesome. I wouldn't change anything about it. It's home, Fisher is home.